Oh, some acquaintance of Sam's over at Westside Hospital is spreading a rumor right now. Dirty, rotten, malicious lie. What? What sort of lie? That you're a lesbian. <laughs> well, and did you rise up to defend my maidenly honor? Oh, Annie, it's not funny. This kind of anonymous nut can make a lot of trouble. I know it. Especially since he's telling the truth. Stop kidding away. Who's kidding? It's the truth. I am a lesbian. I don't believe you. Why not? Because I didn't bite you in the ankle when you asked me for a date? Because I let you kiss me and I enjoyed it? Well, those things would seem incompatible with what you're telling me. Only in your mind, Joe. You hate men, right? Oh, what an ignorant assumption. Who says I do? Sorry. Listen, I put up with you, don't I? Well, forgive me. I'm a little confused. I mean, what are you anyway? A doctor, a lesbian, an actress? Well, then let me enlighten you, doctor. I am a person. I am a woman. I am a psychiatrist. And I am a homosexual. And we are not all the same, any more than heterosexuals are all the same. I am not, I am not repelled by the opposite sex. But on a deeper level, any fulfillment comes with other women, that's all. Is that so hard to understand? Intellectually, no. The homosexual psychiatrist treating a young woman with a sexual problem? Yes. That could have its complications. Not at all. In the first place, my homosexuality has nothing to do with her problems. Secondly, she doesn't have to know anything about my personal life. And thirdly, my, my professional background enables me to understand whatever it is she might be going through, which is why I agreed to take the case at your, your request, if you recall. True. But why couldn't you have told me in front? Why do I have to hear it from somebody else? Oh, oh! When you start treatment of a patient, I suppose uh, you automatically fill out a questionnaire about your sexual preferences, huh? There's a difference, sweetheart. Yes. Your preferences are in the majority. Talking about a critically ill patient. Now, I've staved off this Sam Miller for the time being, but he's an emotional hothead. There's no telling what he may do about this. Is he worried that I'll seduce Toby? Yes, probably yes. And are you worried about that, too? No. Now, look, I'm being honest, and I wish you would be, too. You think you're an enlightened man, free of all prejudice. But somewhere, somewhere in your mind, is the sneaking notion that a lesbian can't be trusted to live up to her professional vows and treat a patient of the same sex without pouncing on her. That's not what I think at all. Joe, do you want me to resign from the case? do that and Toby will see it as rejection and we may never reach it then. And I take it you want me to stay on the case? That's what I said, didn't I? At least until the crisis is resolved. All right. But there are conditions. Such as? That you learn something right now. Lesbians are not a bunch of harridans consumed by a hatred of the opposite sex. Oh, some are, yes, some, but that's too bad for them. People who hate whole chunks of the human race are sick, no matter what mode of sexual preferences. 
But as for me, I live a part of my life in a certain way. And it brings me the normal human share of happiness and pain, just like anyone else. 